That would have been a 320 as well. I'll get it. I just have to do it a few more times. I'm sure I'll get it. Yeah, I had a job one time like that where... And it wasn't even like that the owners were bad people or anything. They just... They were just horrible at hiring people, if that makes sense. Yeah. And they had this habit of just hiring, like, the worst managers on the face of the earth. It was basically what I saw while I was there. And uh, they had this dude that they hired. And, like, everything was going really well while I was there, right? And then they hired this manager. And we, we referred to this guy as the senator because he was polished. <laughs> Right, he was like the most professional present presentation guy I've ever met, right? Man, this dude couldn't do anything right. <laughs> and like when he would take heat, his response was just to like make something up and fire somebody. <laughs> like I caught him doing it. I was like, where did you get this information that you're basing this claim off of? Because I'm the network administrator. I can pull the records, and in fact, I did. And what you're saying is not true. <laughs> like, I caught him doing that, right? And called him out on his crap. Anyway, so it's just one of those, like, what is this? Why is this a thing? Yeah. Um, also, the most obnoxious people in any given workplace are usually the lowest paid. <laughs> There's one thing I've found just from having like access to things and being involved in stuff. Um, same job actually. That place I was I was really glad when we finally left there. Um, but same place. Uh, there was this like one lady that was constantly giving my wife crap because we both worked there at the time, and always just really just stirring up drama. Right? She was. Mm -hmm. Not only was she one of the most, like, cocky people there as far as, like, being in with the, the owner, she was also the lowest paid person there by, like, not a small margin. <laughs> like, I think... Oh, yeah, that works, doesn't it? Yeah, it really is. Um, and this one nurse, like, most everybody that I was working with was really friendly, easy to work with. They would call me when things were wrong and, like... You know, more or less just help me do my job, which was to fix everything. You know, when mm -hmm. you're when you're the person that shows up with the answer to all the problems and you fix everything, you ought to be everybody's favorite person. Like, I would think so. Like you'd think so, right? Well, I had this one nurse that was just really unfriendly, and uh, her husband was an IT guy. So naturally, because her husband was an IT guy, that means that I'm inferior and know nothing. Of course. And, uh, dude, this one lady was just a thorn in my side, like, the entire time I was working at this office. Like, uh -huh. things would go wrong. She would literally, like, go out of her way to make sure that I wasn't able to help. Okay? And, uh, it came t time to do payroll stuff. And, uh, I would also had to help with the payroll because the, like, 80-year-old lady that was doing it really didn't know how. Oh, I got it. I totally got it. 331. Nice. I also I also just got it to 232. Oh, nice. In moon gravity. Yep. 